Hello and my who we are. Today you're gonna be starting with some of the new Call of Duty Black Ops 6. Let's do this. Let's try it, regular. Here we go. An entire class of U.S. Soviet nuclear missiles is eliminated. Means that the era of nuclear disarmament has begun. We will stay the course and we will succeed. Are you denying that? We have discussed what it already. What more do you want, Livingston? Enough! You disobeyed a direct order, Mr. Marshall, when it was clear your op was compromised. With all due respect, sir, you weren't there. And the group that compromised you, the Pantheon, you sure that's who they were? That's what Alawi called them. When are you gonna tell us what's really going on here? I'm asking the questions, Mr. Woods. Sir, if you read the report, you... I read your report, Ms. Harrow. Some of it I still find hard to believe. That's why we're going to go over events again. Only this time, I want to hear it from Marshall. From the beginning. We were in position near the Iraq-Kuwait border. Small team, me, Harrow, and Case. <laughs> Allow you the head of schedule. Whoever he's meeting won't wait around for long. No, not if it's a smuggler. I'm sure Allow has paid top dollar to get himself out of the Middle East. Guess it doesn't really matter. He's coming with us. Outlaw 42, we've got our eyes on the convoy. Paying the target, over. Roger, ground. Target confirmed. Waiting on your go. Over. Do it. Outlaw 42, you're clear to engage. Out. Let's go get him. Copy, ground. Engaging it out. Here comes the traffic jam. I know we have a graphics or multiplier, but I might turn out for the single player, so I'm just gonna see if I can change this setting real quickly. Uh, graphics. Let's see. Extreme. Apply settings. Okay, I'm okay. And I think there's. Move 
Oh, here we go. Okay, this is extreme graphics. Let's go. Lols. I can't remember yet. I can't remember what buttons I'm gonna be behind. So I wish the um, buttons would transfer over. Okay, how's the first checkpoint? One shot. Yes, one shot alone. Who shot me? I should be able to... I can't mount on this. Can I mount on this? I can't mount. It's not me I press alt, I think, so I'm going to change my binding again quickly for that. Right, it's in the keyboard and mouse, key bindings. So I need to change, like, sprints. To bolt. Now let's see if that works. And did save. Yeah. Okay, that feels a bit better. The road. There's a lot of them. This time I'm watching more than I am. Awesome, let's go. Okay, this is the truck. We're gonna check the door. Okay, let's check the door. Whoa, I was jump scared. I got it. Stay calm. We're not here to hurt you. CIA? We had a deal. Deal? Not with us. Where you headed? Corrado, you lied. Your man was getting the man. Who exactly? Is that us? No, not Iraqi either. Pantheon. Pantheon. We need to leave. You won't stand a chance against them. They haven't spotted us. Let's keep it that way. Come on. Let me get this straight, Mr. Marshall. The group you claim to be, the Pantheon, was a multinational, heavily armed paramilitary force that showed up out of the blue. At this point, you're told to wait for backup, but you decide to play cowboy instead. We had to act fast. Our window Ms. was Harrow, closed. did he or did he not disobey your order? Yes, sir, but the accelerated timetable That's made... what I thought. I've come to expect this from you, but not from you. Sir, our objective was to recover Alawi by any means necessary... Oh, I'm aware. So, care to explain why he's on a slab in the morgue right now? Things got complicated. Who are these people? The Pantheon is composed of former European and US operatives. I don't know who leads them. They're blocking our exfil. We call in reinforcements of wait. Wait? What the hell with that? Barrage come in. Where did your way? No, we're compromised. Alawi will slow us down. Alawi, well, you going with us to the Pantheon? I'm going with you. Damn it, Troy. Smart man. Hey, so let's start by softening them up. Okay. Let's get to work, Case. <laughs> so I can do a leg like that? Oh, okay, I see. Please, is it time to think? Oh, wait, there we go. Is that, is that what it is? Then? Oh, does it all do it all to ask, Clay? Okay.
do that care you you could be leading us into an ambush it's the only way out but as we get close but as come in are you sure he'll be there you just worry about not slowing us down we're open targets down here and they'll could pick us up Kill you myself. Yeah. Oh. <laughs> Everyone all right? Is this your No 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 stand down? This new project. You can ease up, son. I'm all done here. Jane. You just killed a high value target in cold blood and put our national security at risk. Halawi can't fall into the Pantheon's hands or Langley's. The CIA is compromised. But it's not me. I'm just the fall guy. You expect us to believe that? Hey, Jane, you want to tape his mouth shut for me? Yes. Wait. I got a message for Woods. Oh, yeah? Tell him Bishop takes Brook. What the hell's that supposed to mean? Time to go. In the truck! to add? Sir, despite breach of conduct and losing Alawi, apprehending Russell Adler is a categorical windfall. Yes, Ms. Harrow. Bringing in a rogue operative is certainly a win. Russell Adler, the mole who betrayed us in Panama, the man responsible for your current condition, Mr. Woods. So why was he trying to tell you something in Kuwait? Bishop takes Rook. Any idea what that means? No clue. Okay, then. Based on Harrow's reluctant report and the withholding of critical information regarding Russell Adler, your team is suspended. Are you for real? This is bullshit. As for you, Miss Harrow, consider yourself on very, very thin ice. People like me and Adler are the reason we ain't speaking Russian right now. The Cold War is over, Mr. Woods. That makes you and Russell Adler the last global gunslingers of a bygone era. 
Take this time to reflect on that. Dismissed. All of you. My office in five. I'd advise you not to pursue this further, Marshal. kept it. Not all reminders need to be scars. <clears throat> Why are we here, Harrow? Because you know something? Care to tell me what it is you're up to? Me and the kids just need some time away. You know, take a little trip. Reflect a little. Look, I can cover your asses on my end best I can. But if things go sideways again, you're on your own. Copy that. Oh, you one. One? Yeah. Try a dozen. Do me a favor, Troy. Don't get yourself killed. I'll see what I can do. Bishop takes Rook. Of course, Woods knew what it meant. Adler was pointing us somewhere. The Black Sea. According to Woods, 15 years ago, he and Adler discovered an abandoned KGB safe house in Bulgaria. It was called the Rook. Last year, before Adler disappeared, he'd been chasing rumors of a dangerous paramilitary group on receiving orders from inside the CIA. He believed the Pantheon was developing a new type of weapon with plans to unleash something the world had never seen before. And wouldn't you know it, soon evidence surfaced incriminating Adler himself, and he fled to this place. What we found here over the last couple days has changed everything. Now I'm questioning what I believed about Adler, about Livingston, about the CIA itself. I have my doubts about going dark on Jane. Woods might be right about her value on the inside, but she'll be in the crosshairs if Langley learns what we're up to. Adler brought us here for a reason, to stop the Pantheon before they strike. To do that, Woods believes we'll need him back. That won't be easy. But Adler left a name to follow. It's a good place to start. No more wasting time. You know the plan. Savati Duma, the person you're gonna meet. Still no idea why Adler was in contact with her, but a lead's a lead. We can't trust her. I doubt if Adler did. Hell, for all we know, she's part of this fucking Pantheon thing. Who can we trust? Duma agreed to meet Case in Avalon, so we're doing this. Well, well, well. Look at you putting your big boy pants on. Shouldn't we find Adler before making this call? Well, that's exactly why I'm going to meet one and dine your old friend. Friend? Hardly. I can't stand the son of a bitch. But we need him. We're trying to do the right operation. Well, I love a G bind for the spotlight. <laughs> why doesn't he have many and different G bindings? <laughs> What's what's it about? Spy camera. That be it. Now we're moving. Okay, so we're gonna. Come on, bye bye. Be 
something like that. Something like Jeter is like... Still outside, am I just leaving? Jesus, what can I just go somewhere? I'm supposed to be talking to someone, but can I just leave? Why have I done out here? What do we have? What do we have? We're gonna So do you crack the damn bedroom save? Still look at this year and find contacts, get the furnace going. So we're gonna do all these things. Turn to missionary out okay, I can't live. I'm gonna get the furnace going now. Where's the furnace? Yeah, let's go back. Okay, anything in the, the kitchen? In the upstairs? Okay, okay, okay. Well, this place is quite big. The book says that everything, but, you know. What's going on? That'll take you too long to do, so I am just going to, uh, do whatever this is. Just what we found in Atlas Files. An assassin, maybe 30 years old, came from one of Avalon's crime factions, the Guild. Fears she was raised through the Guild and then exiled or left, don't know. Whatever it is, Adler was interested, so I am too. You got it. See you back here on Thursday. <sighs> All right. What kind of life savings you got? <laughs> ah, no wonder you're still alive, Case. Always serving up the top sirloin of bullshit. I'm gonna cut to it. We can't do shit with this house, considering our money situation. This place might have been fine for Adler, but for a team? I'm thinking overhaul, an armory, place to train, gear bench, not to mention anything else we might end up needing. Serves that won't be free, though. Marshall found a few grand stashed in one of the rooms upstairs. Other than that, we're starting fresh. No touching our old bank accounts, either. Someone will be watching. When you're on a mission, look around for any cash lying around. You're gonna Robin Hood your way through this. Steal from the rich, and give to the poor. That's me. We were following an old KGB trail, and a single recording led us here. Seemed abandoned. When we asked our mole inside the KGB about it, he knew nothing. Belikov thought maybe it was some kind of splinter group, not sanctioned by the Central Committee. Whatever it was, it doesn't look like a red stepped foot in here since 1968. Yeah, I don't think he wanted to get others involved. Looks like he was working on a trust list. As far as I can tell, he didn't contact anyone. That's probably why Adler was talking to Dumas. Keeping it outside of Langley. We're gonna do the same. At least for now. The board behind me is how we'll track our spending. Give it a look. <laughs> 